hold. <clears throat> Thank you, Stilgar, for the gift of your body's moisture. <laughs> Welcome back, super friends and super family. I am Thor, your friendly neighborhood god of thunder, and today I'm once again joined by my friend Lexi. Hi. And we will be reacting to Dune. So I have seen this movie. I saw this in IMAX. I was really just excited to see it on the big screen. Lexi has not seen it, and she does not know anything really about the story. Is that correct? Yeah, nothing. I know Zendaya and Timothy Chalamet are in it, and that's about it. Okay, okay, perfect. So I, I'm really excited for her to be going in blind, and I also am planning on reading the book, possibly doing a live stream about it, maybe doing a book review. So anyone who's interested in my thoughts about the book, that's something that I will be doing here on the channel. Really excited about that. And uh, we are also reacting to Interstellar. So we have that movie reaction up right now on Lexi's channel. So Lexi, of course, reacts to Buffy the Vampire Slayer. She also is doing branching out doing some cool movie reactions so if you want to head over and check out our reaction to interstellar which is a great movie for anyone who's never seen it please go right over the link is going to be in the description watch our reaction to that get some good get some good emotions out you guys know it's an emotional one then you can come back here and check out uh check out doom and if you do want to see the full unedited version of this movie and of interstellar as well it's going to be out at the same time you can check that out on both of our patreons uh Please, like I said, head over to Lexi's channel, show some love over there, and yeah, if you want to hang out for the full movie, they're gonna be on uh, on Patreon. So we'll see you guys over there. So have you seen like the trailer for this movie? I haven't. Okay. So okay. I I know what the characters look like. I can know the blue eyes, and there's like something in the nose. Honestly, okay. are they humans though? Are they aliens? I have no idea. Like I've seen the pictures of them, and I've seen like this desolate planet okay like the poster okay. but that's all it is so i have actually no idea like i've never read the book i haven't seen i think there was like another dune movie at some point like earlier yeah yeah there was i never saw that one yeah so i don't know the plot at all okay that, that's perfect yeah. so i just have a few visuals that's great yeah. going into this practically blind uh i'm very excited uh let's just get into the movie So they're not friends. No. No. They're not playing games of Uno Friday nights together. Damn. Only rich. Richer than the Emperor himself. Is that David Bautista? Yeah. Oh. This movie has an insane cast. Oh my god. These people were dedicated to killing them other people. I mean, talk about a badass ambush. Like, literally out of the sand, dude. <gasps> One day, by imperial decree, they were gone. Not suspicious. And who will our next oppressors be? Okay, intense. Oh, part one. Oh my god. Yeah. <laughs> I knew there were like multiple books, but I didn't think they would market it as part one. So does that mean? It and ends? apparently, they didn't green light the sequel until after this came out. So it's kind of a gamble that they would even make part two. That would have been a little bit of a baseball if they haven't managed to get a part two. <laughs> it's just yes. like part one part one of one part that's it yeah you complete the rest with your imagination okay <laughs> exactly if you want it make me give it to you use the voice mom i just woke up does he have some sort of superpower give me the water, water. Okay. More dreams. <gasps> Did 
To be honest, I'm also dreaming about Zendaya. <laughs> Relatable. <laughs> <laughs> the Fremen shared a deep desert with the giant sandworms, known to the Fremen as Shai Hulud. Don't like sandworms. Little else is known of the Fremen, except that they are dangerous and unreliable. Oh, that seems like propaganda. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, it's like we don't know anything about them except we hate them, okay? <laughs> They're very dangerous. <laughs> I love the scope and like the enormity like of the ships that they show and like the way that it's shot showing the bulk of it compared to other objects. Like you really feel that size. Yeah, you really know that these are the people who are like so rich and can just get away with anything. Yeah. Like lo yeah. look at the size of that, the, the carpet. Like look how many people can fit on the carpet. Like it's massive. Smile, Gurney. I am smiling. <laughs> if this formality. Oh my God. Three guild navigators. What's his eye? 1.46 million 62 salaries round trip. Honestly, I thought I went insane for a sec. I was like, did his eyes really do that? The Emperor asks us to bring peace to Arrakis. House Atreides accepts. Atreides! 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 What are these shots? <laughs> Nothing to be worried about whatsoever. No, nope. seems great. They're just bringing peace. When has that exactly. ever gone wrong? Duncan. Oh boy. Hey. <laughs> Honestly, it's kind of funny how they have just normal names. Like, usually sci-fi people have like the weirdest names and he's just like, Duncan. And I think his name is Paul or something. <laughs> yeah, Paul, <laughs> yeah. so yeah. cool, I love it. I saw you. With the Fremen. Uh. He's like psychic? I saw you lying dead. Fallen in battle. No, not Aquaman. Me, you. Put on some muscle. I did? No. <laughs> yeah, he's a little bit skinny. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, compared to Momoa, I don't care who you are, you're gonna feel inferior. It's like, okay. I know. You're just like, oh, I'm so small compared to him. <laughs> Father, I'd like to ask you to join Duncan Idaho on a scout mission to Arrakis tomorrow. You see, there's a pretty girl that I just have to meet her. <laughs> a great man doesn't seek to lead. He's called to it. And he answers. And if your answer is no, you'll still be the only thing I ever needed you to be. Oh, his son? My son. Okay, I like them. Yeah, isn't, isn't that a really good moment between the two of them? It like, is. That says so much about their relationship. I found my own way to it. Maybe you'll find yours. I really thought they were supposed to be the bad guys. And then Zendaya's people are the good guys, but now I'm conflicted. I think it'll be a little bit more complicated. <laughs> That's rude. Oh my goodness. Oh, okay. Oh, is it like a little shield? Yeah. That's neat. Oh. Ah, the slow blade penetrates the shield. I will remember that for later. <laughs> <laughs> I have you. I. But look down, my lord. You're to join me in death. I see you found the mood. <laughs> your eyes. I need to see it in your eyes. You never met Harkonnens before. I have. They're not human. They're brutal. Hmm. Interesting. I'm pretty sure that the re the they don't like there's not a lot of guns in warfare because of those protective body suits. So they use swords actually because that technology has kind of made guns and bullets obsolete. Yeah, because he said that like if it's going slowly, then it can penetrate the shield. Yeah. Whereas a bullet would yeah. always go super fast. So it makes sense. Exactly. Rubber. The last of our ships have left Arrakis. It's done. A dangerous, jealous man. He has some like little red dots on his back, which concern me. <laughs> I love how you look like I, well, how I look like during Buffy, like. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> like I, I don't know anything. Don't know nothing. <laughs> this can't be good. Who are these? 
Oh, it's like that lady. Oh, oh, it's a light. That's handy. I mean, that, I mean, that's awesome, right? I yeah. wish I had that every time I got up to go to the bathroom in the middle of the night. Like, walk with me. Exactly. And it's not that bright, so you don't, like, get fully awake. Yeah. My teacher at the Bene Gesserit School, she's now truth sayer to the Emperor himself. She would like to meet you. You see how they speak to each other in sign language? That's pretty cool. I'm assuming that's like not very common, so like they can hide what they're saying. Exactly. I'm sorry, sir. Could you clear your throat? Because I did not understand you. Defiance in the eyes. Oh, there was a lady. My bad. You dismissed my mother in her own house. Come here. Kneel. Put your right hand in the box. Oh god, no, don't do that. Your mother bade you obey me. Oh no, 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 no. Oh no, 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 no. Oh, I hold at your neck the gom java. Poison needle. Instant death. The test is simple. Remove your hand from the box. And you die. Your mother stands behind that door. No one will get past her. What does that mean? That he's basically got no choice but to do this test. An animal caught in a trap will gnaw off its own leg to escape. What will you do? Die. E easy choice. Instant death? Sounds good to me. <laughs> Can she feel his pain? Fear's the mind killer. Fear is the little death that brings obliteration. What did you see? A girl on Arrakis. Have you dreamt of her before? All the time. That's private, lady. <laughs> what happens in my mind stays in my mind. Goodbye, young human. Young human. I hope you live. <laughs> Thank you so much. <laughs> that sounded very concerned about his well-being. I hope you live. I mean, <laughs> whatever. I do hope it, but if it doesn't happen, it's no big deal. So much potential wasted in a male. You were told to bear only daughters, but you and your pride thought you could produce the Kwisatz Haderach. Okay, interesting. So he has some sort of destiny. And she chose a son? Okay. <laughs> interesting that they can just do that in the future. But she belongs to the Bene Gesserit. Yeah, and they have some powers, right? Like they can use the yeah. boys. And apparently some people, or maybe all of them, have the sight. Yeah, or maybe. I, I'm not. That's one thing I'm not clear on all the exact lore, like what exactly they can do. But I know they have powers, right? Yeah. But then it felt like that guy, who like his eyes went white. He also had some sort of power, but he was from the house of the bull. So I'm pr I'm pretty sure the guy with the eyes are like uh, AI robots. Oh. Who can like look stuff up, like facts, something like that. We've been carefully crossing bloodlines to bring forth one. A mind powerful enough to bridge space and time past and future who can help us into a better future we think he's very close now some believe he's here it's all part of the plan Honestly, kind of a shitty thing to learn that you were brought to the earth just so that you could fulfill this like weird century old destiny thing. Like that's why your mom wanted you. Honestly, right? It's like, I didn't actually want a child. I just wanted to be the one who gets to birth the heir to this thing. Like, like you're part of this huge like galaxy wide plan to set something up that you really had no idea about. Yeah. It's like no one asked me. Like, excuse me, could someone ask? have asked for my permission for this? No, I yeah. just trusted it, I guess. 
I mean, I don't know. Any any group that shows up in their spaceship in the pouring rain in the dark wearing those creepy veils, my trust for them is like pretty low. Yeah. And then they torture you as well. Like, yeah. <laughs> not very cuddly or warm. Honestly, just follow Zendaya. I'm sure she's great. Let's just follow her. <laughs> That's what your instincts are saying. Like, you could follow her. Yeah. Like, screw everybody else. Do what she wants to do. And if she turns out to be evil, well, that's just too bad. Then you become evil as well. That's all you can do, really. Just gamble everything on her. <laughs> exactly. Shield. They're expecting a warm welcome, putting shields on before they open the door. Yes. Like, okay. We're here to bring peace. Everybody, <laughs> warm up. I like how much wind and like sand you can see on camera. Like it really makes you feel like they're in a real locate. Like I'm pretty sure a lot of this was shot like in desert locations, like on set, not just on a, a sound stage with green screen. Yeah, because that's exactly what I was thinking. I was like, I wonder when they shot this. I'm assuming there's like actual desert and just like green screen split up for like the spaceships. Yeah. So huge. Like look at how tiny people are. I know, it. right? That is to me one of the really cool aspects of the movie. It's just like the scope and size of the, you know, their their yeah. sci-fi technology. Because even if you're like picture like a plane is pretty huge, right? But yeah. then when you stand next to it, you're like way bigger than these people are compared to this. So it's like yeah. I feel like I can't even imagine something that big that can like fly. Yeah. That's so it kinda looks like a dragonfly. It uh, right? Yeah, it's really interesting. They look so real to me. Like the this uh, way they blended CG and practical, like seeing these ships, I'm like, these look like real things flying yeah. through the air. I really wanna watch like the behind the scenes for this. Like I wanna see how much was like real and how much was CGI. Cause like the landscape here looks so real. Like the foreground, like the sand mountain thing is, they look yeah. super real. Whoa protects the city from the weather and the worms oh the worms oh i, I forgot about the worms oh no <laughs> i'm sure we're gonna see them at some point i'm gonna be very <laughs> unhappy about it honestly it looks cool but i would be so sad if i was born on this planet <laughs> just everything is yes. sand it's like yeah. you go to the beach once and you have sand everywhere like living here all the time just being in stuck Sand? You're like, this is everything all the time. Honestly, oh, sounds like a nightmare. I mean, you saw that scene with Paul, like, putting his hand in the water on his home planet before leaving. I was like, yeah, you enjoy that. <laughs> enjoy the greenery and the cool blue color palettes. Yeah. We're here now. What do they say about this hellhole again? To shower, you scrub your ass with sand, my lord. That's what they say. <laughs> sounds I think good. they agree with you. They're not too excited to be here. I know. <laughs> I know that you have a weapon concealed in your bodies. If you mean to harm me, I must warn you whatever you're hiding, it won't be enough. The weapon is meant as a gift. If you are truly the one. It's a gift. Let me put it into your stomach for safekeeping. <laughs> it's a crisp knife. Do you know its meaning? Oh! Okay. Why was the screaming necessary? It is yours. Tooth of shine. Interesting scene. Don't know what it means yet. I don't know everything. I mean, clearly there's a very strong, like, religious and, like, they're believing in a coming savior, like the local people here on Arrakis. Yeah. And there's, there's prophecies about him, like a mother and a son, you know, things like that, where they're like, oh, this is our savior. This must be them. But like Paul was saying, it's like, oh, the Bene Gesserit were there, you know, planting that superstition so they could have control. So is it that influence, you know? That's very interesting. The largest and most dangerous organism on Arrakis is the sandworm. Capable of reaching 400 meters. No, why did they say it in meters? Now I understand how big that is. <laughs> Using the sand walk, a dance like motion with irregular rhythm, which emulates the natural sounds of the. Oh, I'm so here for a Timothy Chalamet Zendaya dance. 
against the sandworms. <laughs> Cling to life in a parched, nutrient-poor landscape. Um... That's so cute. What is it? Oh, that's so cool in his shirt. Oh, his shield! Oh, you stupid bitch! <laughs> oh, it detects movement. Oh, what is that? The thing must leave. If you can speak without fear. Oh, God! My pet doesn't understand your language. Get out! Oh no. Oh god, no. No, 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 no. Okay, isn't that so creepy? I hate that. And the desert takes the weak. My desert. Oh. I thought he was a mermaid for a sec, not gonna lie. <laughs> okay, there are so many people cooling. I can't keep up. <laughs> him with his little umbrella. I love it. <laughs> Why is he the only one with one? Everyone else was too embarrassed. They're like, no, we'll, we'll suffer the heat. It's like, we're men, <laughs> we're gonna suffer. And the robot is like, y'all are dumb. <laughs> we'll get a bit of imperial protection. A hostage. <laughs> I love it. Hostage? <laughs> so casual. I like the sound effects as well. Like... Yeah, right? For the these things, I like it for the shields. Like they're really well done. <gasps> is that Jason Momoa? Oh, it's not. Oh, it is. <laughs> oh, yeah, he dying. <laughs> Honestly, <laughs> <laughs> like it's just too happy right now. I know. I don't trust it. I've been watching Buffy. I can't trust anything. Stop there. Hey! Hey! Hold. <clears throat> Thank you, Stilgar, for the gift of your body's moisture. <laughs> I know you've suffered at the hands of the Harkonnen. Name what you want. If it's in my power to grant, I'll give it and ask for nothing. Leave. That's very honorable. I must go. That's all I have to say to you. Won't you stay? Honor requires that I be elsewhere. She gave she. So is that like the language of the his mom's people? I think that's the language of the Fremen, but I, like I said, I, I I don't know all the lore and things like that. I could be giving wrong information too. A, a lot of the stuff I know, <laughs> like kind of just pieced together. I return to the desert. Part of it. It's part of them. You wait till you see it. Yes, that's where Zendaya is. Honestly, it's been an hour. Where is she? <laughs> <laughs> like you've been dreaming long enough. Let's see the real girl. Exactly. With your permission, sire, I must check the integrity of your. <laughs> Oh, it's all right. And then they're shocked when the people are like hostile towards them. <laughs> I think they're just a little on edge with anyone approaching Paul after that assassination. They're like, hold on a second. Honestly, you're saying something. <laughs> Inside the mask, you'll find a tube to allow you to drink the recycled water. Mm. I'm sorry. The recycled water is my own sweat that I'm drinking? Yummy. Ooh. That's pretty. Yeah, I would enjoy the desert from this view. You know, this yeah. high up, I'd be like, I'll do a, it's a flyover. And exactly. then I'll go back to the a AC. I mean, you could interior. ask if they have AC on the helicopter. You know, you could be like, is there a little bit of an AC going on in the chopper? Like, is there yeah, a possibility? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Honestly, I've been to the Egyptian desert before and it's just so hot. And like when it's like windy, it's just like the wind is like burning your skin. It gets really? so, yeah, it gets insanely hot. So I can understand like 
dressing up like this. Like it makes sense. Like it could make sense on Earth already. Worms travel deep but get closer to the surface when they attack. If you are patient, you should see one. Um, I'm very impatient. Let's get the hell out of here. <laughs> You're like, let's go. Let's go now. <laughs> let's go, let's go. Ready for docking sequence. Contact five minutes. Over. Five minutes? For 3.7 kilometers? I d don't like that. Let's make it three minutes, huh? <laughs> of course, of course! <sighs> the way it just went. We'll find a way. Oh, that's cool. <laughs> Delta Ajax Niner, put seven men each in my ships now. Honestly, I love that he's actually trying to save the people. Like, I feel like that's not that common. Wouldn't be that common. I mean, I guess they rely on them for the spies. But still, he's no, really I, like, I... throw our stuff away. Like, we're going to find a way. Like, we're going to get them out of here. Yeah. And putting themselves at risk. Like, and just immediately just snaps into action. Like, all right, we're doing it. We're yeah. going to find a way to save these guys. Yeah, I really like that. I want every man off that crawler now. Okay, I'm digging him. <laughs> oh, goodness gracious. Oh my god, put your little mask on! Excuse me? <laughs> Can he hear the worm? Can he use the voice to control the worm? Is he leaving? Sir, your son is still on the ground. Just kneeling. Having a moment. May his passage cleanse the world and keep the world for his people. Ooh. Ooh. Oh, no, 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 no. <laughs> that is vile. All right, that is massive. Yeah, yeah, it's 400 meters long. I remember. I can visualize that. That's, that's way too long. <laughs> Like, why would you eat it, though? What kind of nutritional values could it have? Spice is a psychoactive chemical. You seem to be sensitive. You'll be fine. He just had a trip out in the desert. Nothing to be concerned about. It's all good. A little vision quest. <laughs> totally normal. That could happen to anybody. That's our queen. Oh, he has a nose thing as well. Yeah. Interesting. Oh, is she killing him? Oh. Ah, stay rooting for Zendaya. I'm sorry, dude. <laughs> you seem nice, but... Someone will hand me a blade. But I don't know who, or when, or where. Is that the mom? I know you're pregnant. Is she trying again? She's like, I gave up on your son already. I'm doing the next one. I better know that it's only been a few weeks. That was a lot of information. She's like, it's impossible to keep secrets in this family. <laughs> it's like, God damn it, I shouldn't have had a son. <laughs> These visions are killing me. <laughs> this robot is not doing too well. Someone check on his circuit brakes. <laughs> We haven't seen the Emperor yet, right? Mm -mm. Okay. Emperor. There's something you need to know about Paul. No. Oh. I thought she was gonna be like, I'm Preggers! Will you protect our son? With my life. I'm not asking his mother, I'm asking the Bene Gesserit. No? <laughs> Probably not. Why are you having these thoughts? She did not answer the question. <laughs> Thought we'd have more time. Is he dying? Honestly, I'm stressed. So far, I like every character pretty much. So, <laughs> well, the mom's a little bit shady. Yeah, that's, that's a very good point. Like she didn't answer. She like dodged that question. She know? she really like, was why like, why are you thinking this way? Yeah, uh, you, you're crazy. She really went yeah. with like, I don't know what you're saying. Instead of like, mm -hmm. yeah, of course. 
Yeah. Don't trust her, especially that she's pregnant again. I should have married you. Did you say I should have married you? Yeah. Oh. I'm pretty sure she's his concubine. Oh boy. Howard, security. Security. Oh no, I. T oh, okay, good. At least you did that. <gasps> no, 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 no. Doctor? Oh my god. Is he dead? God in heaven. Get everything with guns off the ground! Go! Oh god. Oh shit. Oh. That's a big ship. Yeah. I'm assuming it's the bold people. Knives? Swords? What you gonna do with that against these things? Oh gosh. That's such an unbelievably cool way to like light the battle with like all the explosions and it's yeah. so dark besides that. Okay, y'all are very cool. <laughs> Oh my god, they can fly? Oh, what kind of chance do you have? Oh, wow. Yeah, so the, the guys in white of the Sadu car, like the guys that they hired, right? The super good warriors, they said. Oh, those are the bald dudes who were like... Well, at the planet where it was raining, and they were saying like, why do, why do you guys need to hire us? And they like hired a few legions or whatever. Those yeah. are the Sadu car, I think they're called. Okay. Why? I had no choice. The Harkonnens have my wife, Mona. You little bitch. I mean, I get it, but you little bitch. Yes, I know, like, he's the traitor. I'm going to replace your back tooth. This tooth will crash. Breathe out, and you will fill the air with poison. Yo, what the fuck? I don't like this. Oh. Watch out, Duncan. <laughs> No, 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 the thing is... Oh. Yeah. That's letter of the law bullshit. It's like, oh, we technically did. It was the worms. Like, seriously? It's just like, we just left them in the desert that, like, kills humans with, like, a huge worm. But, yeah. like, it wasn't us. They could have we gotten there. Promise. Exactly. They could have gotten there anyway. Like, they could have just yeah. walked out there. I mean, who knows? The hell, dog? Look at his the rest power. Of them just back away. <laughs> He's like, you know what? I respect it. <laughs> He's like, I respect you. The ship is yours. Yeah, yeah it's not worth it. We yeah, won't tell anyone. Yeah, yeah, it's fine. I get paid regardless of this. Okay, that is one destructive laser pointer. Like, yeah. you're ruining everything. I know. Why did he do a lab? He was like, oh, you know what? I see a little bit of building that hasn't been ruined yet. Let me just make sure a lab. I do a yeah. lab so that it can be ruined. Chase and Momoa. <laughs> so, what's the plan? Remove her gag. Oh, I don't think he's gonna do that. Is he? Yep. Shut up. I'm pretty sure that's gonna kill him if you just throw him out. 